something up there. somehow. The Maria Dula is trapped. The ice gave way. Her spine snapped in two. No matter. While I hope to wield her cannons against the false prophet, we will continue on foot. I have six of the Order of Trinity's best, and we have been stockpiling food and supplies while the sailors starved. They do not know it yet, but they will give their life for the cause. My men and I will find our way out of these icy caves and continue on foot. Before the ship was swallowed by the ice to the south, we heard music. That will be our first stop. But first I must rest. The cold has sunk into my bones, and I am drowsy. Just a little sleep.
now to find out what's up there. with them. It's done. We'll die here, thanks to Coraldus and the madness of the Order of Trinity. My ship will never see water again. We entered the glacial sea too far into the winter. Would have been turned back, but Coraldus would not abandon this lost prophet. He and his dead-eyed warriors seized control. He forced the ship through shallow tributaries until we could go no further. Then he made my crew construct sled runners, and the bastard forced us to tow the ship over land. It was death and excommunication to deny him. But it was death either way. I will make sure he dies here, with us. I've always kept a little poison at the ready, in case the ship was taken. Now, it has another use. archery techniques of the foes of the Byzantine Empire. <laughs> 